In this video, I will be going over some key features of editing videos that will help your finished projects turn out even better than they already are. For the sake of this video, I will be demonstrating it in Media.io Browser, a really simple to use editing tool with built-in AI that I'll also go over how to apply. The topics I will be going over are how to add music to your YouTube video, how to add subtitles to your video, how to remove unwanted objects from the video, and how to remove the background in the video. Feel free to skip around in the video to find out what you need help with, or watch it all the way through to learn some extra tools that might be useful down the line. To start off, head to your browser and type in media.io. This will take you to their website, where you can access the tool by simply clicking on Get Started Free. Alternatively, you can also click the link in our description, which will take you directly to the browser tool. From here, you can choose to log in to save your progress easier. Before we start with any of the topics I mentioned earlier, we first need some footage to work with. To import your videos, click on New Project in the top right corner and choose which aspect ratio you want to edit in. Since we are focusing on YouTube, we will select 16 by 9, but feel free to select whatever fits your project. Now, select the Upload button or the Click to Upload square in the middle of the screen, select your videos and press Open. Depending on how large the file sizes are, it might take some time to finish importing. Once it's all done, we can start with the fun part. First up, let's talk about how to add background music to your video. Media.io takes this process and makes it really simple, which we can see when we select the audio tab on the left. Here you will find a lot of different songs to use within your video, and you can use them by just simply dragging it down into your editing timeline at the bottom of the screen. If you want to preview it first, simply just click on the song to hear what it sounds like. If none of these songs do it for you, there is also an option to create a new song using AI. For this, you want to select AI generated music at the very top of the list. From here, you can either select a genre you want or give it a text prompt. For either option, you can select how long the song should be and also preview it. Once a new song has been generated, it will be added to a collection below for you to reuse in a different project. This is a great way to add custom sound to your videos. Next up, let's go over how to add subtitles to your video. This step is usually a very, very time consuming step, but Media.io makes it simple. All you have to do is go to the left sidebar and click on subtitles. Here you select the language your video is in which part of the video on your timeline you want to add subtitles to, and finally, if you wanted to translate the content into another language or not. Click on Generate, and you're done! Super easy and adds great accessibility to your videos. For our next two tools, we want to use a slightly different version of the Media.io browser. If you want to remove unwanted objects inside of your video, you will need to go to your browser and type this into your search bar. You can also click the link in our description below to go directly to the website. After that, you want to select Image Video Object Remover and click on Upload here to select the video you want to use. Once your video is imported, you can scroll through the video and start painting the area you wish to remove. On the right hand side, you can change the size of the brush or swap over to an eraser brush. Once you're ready, click on Remove Objects Now and wait for the AI to do its job. You can preview the video once it's ready to make sure you're happy with it, and then choose if you want to download, edit again, or upload a new file. Our last tool uses this website, which you can once again find by typing it into your browser or clicking on the link in the description of this video. With this tool, we are going to remove the background of our video. Again, it's a super simple process thanks to its AI features, and we'll start off by uploading our footage once again. This part might take a bit of time depending on how large the file is, but once it's imported and processed, you'll be able to select some different background removing options. You can choose different solid colors, gradients, textures, or graphics, as well as stock images or your own uploaded images to replace the background with. You can of course also leave the background empty. When you've selected your options, simply press download in the top right corner and you're all done. And that's it for this video, but please let us know in the comments down below if you want more editing tips in the future. Thanks again for today's sponsor, Media.io, 
Make sure to check out all the links in the description for the different editing tools we talked about today and much more. As usual, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more content and check out our socials at camxpetra for daily uploads. Thank you all for watching. Bye.